Timotheus Rishon, 1 Timothy 1. Paul, an apostle of Yahusha HaMashiach, by the commandment of Yahuwah, our Savior, and Adonai Yahusha HaMashiach, which is our hope. Unto Timotheus, my own son in the belief, grace, mercy, and peace from Yahuwah, our Father, and Yahusha HaMashiach, our Adonai. As I besought you to abide still at Ephesus when I went into Macedonia, that you might charge some that they teach no other doctrine, neither give heed to fables and endless genealogies, which minister questions rather than edification in the belief of Yahuwah. Now the goal of the commandment is love out of a pure heart, and of a good conscience, and of belief unfeigned, from which some have swerved, rather having swerved, have turned aside unto vain jangling, desiring to be teachers of the Torah, understanding neither what they say nor whereof they affirm. But we know that the Torah is good, if a man conducts himself in it in accordance to the Torah. Knowing this, that the Torah is not made for a righteous man, but for the wicked and disobedient, for the unholy and for sinners, for them without Yahuwah and profane, for murderers of fathers and murderers of mothers, for manslayers, for whoremongers, for them that defile themselves with mankind, for men-stealers, for liars, for perjured persons, and if there be any other thing that is contrary to sound doctrine, according to the glorious Besara of the blessed Yahuwah, which was committed to my trust. And I thank Yahusha HaMashiach, our Adonai, who has enabled me, for that he counted me faithful, putting me into the ministry, who was before a blasphemer and a persecutor and injurious, but I obtained mercy because I did it ignorantly in unbelief. And the grace of our Adonai was exceeding abundant with belief and love, which is in Yahusha HaMashiach. This is a faithful saying and worthy of all acceptation, that Yahusha HaMashiach came into the world to save sinners, of whom I am chief. Howbeit, for this cause I obtained mercy, that in me first Yahusha HaMashiach might show forth all long suffering for a pattern to them which should hereafter believe on him to life everlasting. Now unto the King eternal, immortal, invisible, the only wise Yah, be honor and glory forever and ever. Amen. This charge I commit unto you, son Timotheus, according to the prophecies which went before you, rather, before on you, that you by them might war a good warfare, holding belief and a good conscience, which some having put away concerning belief have made shipwreck, of whom is Hymenius and Alexander, whom I have delivered unto Satan, that they may learn not to blaspheme.